There's one dwarf planet whose very existence is a mystery. It's called Sedna. And no one is quite sure what it's doing in our solar system. Sedna may have my vote for the single most peculiar object in the entire solar system. Here we have a world which is about a thousand miles wide, but it is way far out in the solar system, way past Neptune. Sedna is the most distant object we've identified in our solar system. Standing on the surface of Sedna, looking back at the solar system, the sun would look like a really bright star, but not much more than a really bright star. Just like Pluto, Sedna has a strange elliptical orbit. The difference is, Sedna travels from 7 billion to 93 billion miles from the sun. And unlike Pluto, its orbit can't be explained by its close proximity to Neptune. The weird thing about Sedna is its orbit. How could it have gotten that elliptical when it's that far away from any of the major planets? If you have an object that's close enough to Neptune, Neptune's gravity can affect its orbit and swing it into an elliptical orbit. The problem is Sedna never gets that close to Neptune. It doesn't get anywhere near close enough to be in that kind of orbit. And that means that something else is going on out there. Sedna cannot be explained using objects that we know. Everything else, we can understand why it's where it is based on you know, the eight planets and many, many other small bodies. Sedna cannot be explained by that. And that was, you know, that's, that's the sign of a good mystery. Something else must have happened. Looking at models for how you can change the orbits of objects, there's almost no way Sedna could have formed in our solar system and then had its orbit change so that it's that elliptical and goes that far out from the sun. And that means maybe, maybe it didn't form here. It may be an alien world.